And the floodlights are shining down on the players already here at the Estadio Benito Via Marin. I'm Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry, and alongside me at the microphone is Stuart Robson. I'm looking forward to bringing you action from the Spanish top flight, La Liga. It's Real Betis versus Barcelona. Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface, and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. Well, how about Canales as a player who can do the lot? Stuart, in your opinion, what will we see from him in this match? Well, Derek, we know he loves linking up with other players, but it's when he's in and around the penalty area, that's when he's at his most dangerous, when he plays little one-twos around his marker and then plays the next forward pass into a runner. He could be the key to unlocking this defence. Well, here's the Betis starting 11. Claudio Bravo is the goalkeeper. Bartra plays alongside Herman Pezzella in central defence. Canales plays with Juanmi on the flanks. And the central striker is Borja Iglesias. Well, this is what we think for Barcelona. Marc-André Ter Stegen stands between the posts. Frenkie de Jong plays with Sergio Busquets in central midfield. And operating in attack today, Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. And now they get the ball rolling. The attack continues, they're making considerable progress. And let's give credit to the defending. Plenty of running room in the wide position. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Nabil Fekir. Well, what can they do to stop him running at them? Rodriguez. Fekia. And that will be a corner. Let's see about the delivery. Well, they couldn't get the header on the target, but you've got to give credit to the defending. Pedri Obama Young De Jong onto Obama Young oh in with a chance well he was on his own he had the goalkeeper to beat but failed to do so. Well, he just needed to show a bit more composure there. Take a little bit off the shot, I think. Is it going to end up being productive for them? But they took care of the situation defensively. Pedri. He's in with a chance. And there it is. 1-0. The efforts have been rewarded. And look at the celebrations. Well, here it is again. And he only had one thing on his mind. Hit it as hard as he could. And he certainly did that. What a good goal. Oh, 
are back underway and 1 0 it is. Let's see what happens next. Obama Yang, he's in behind. Superb save. Well, he should score, of course, but that's a brilliant save. Trying to deliver it accurately. And that attack going up a dead end. And the keeper has the ball. Pedri. De Jong. Now for Bamiyang. Gonna get a try. Well, somehow the goalkeeper got to it. Can he deliver it with accuracy? It hasn't come to very much. Barca maintain possession. Advantage. Torres. Perfect tackle. Obama Yang. De Jong and Torres on the ball very quick thinking there well let's get more details on the injury situation from our pitch side reporter Jeff Shreves yeah you can see he's got a problem with his foot it looks as though he's treading on it a little tenderly I think he actually got trodden on in that last challenge cheers Jeff Hector Bellerin now Canales and options in the centre. And there the attack ends for now. The first half here comes to an end. Well, Frankie de Jong was busy. He was difficult to subdue in the first 45. How would you sum up what you saw from him? Well, it was certainly a good first 45 minutes for the lad. Obviously, he got his goal to put them in front, but he's looked lively throughout too. Hopefully, we see more of him in the second half. And the referee sounding the second half into action. It's Barcelona with the lead here. Germán Pezzella. Now Canales. Oh, he's given the ball away unnecessarily. A chopping challenge. And the referee has got to have a big think about it. Well, he's gone into the book. Well, he was late and he deserved a booking for that. Torres. This looks more than decent. But the danger averted for now. And he's through here. And it's in! A goal for Barcelona! They are the team in charge! Well, let's see this again. He tries to run out with the ball. He has the ball taken off of him. He's made the wrong decision. And suddenly the ball's in the back of the net. Terrible defense.
defending. Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. Joaquin. Gives it a go. The save was a good one. Jordi Alba. And into the last 30 minutes now. And on the back of that particular challenge, will the referee let the matter rest there? Well, deemed to have been a cautionable offence. Well, no question about it. He deserved his book in there. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Torres. Pedri. On a pretty ordinary challenge. There it is! The goals keep coming! No stopping them today! Well, as you can see, he beats the defenders so easily with a change of pace, and then it's a decent finish. That's a very good goal, you have to say. the game and the fact of the matter is Barca are handing out a very harsh lesson good looking sequence but they took care of the situation defensively Pedri well let's see what they have in store for them on the break De Jong in position well, it was a superb counter-attack, but no goal. Yeah, really good play. Won the ball back well and then countered with great speed. That deserved the goal. This has been a top-class display today. Just look how many chances they've created. And if they want to, they could score a hatful of goals here. Well, they no longer have the ball. Pierre Emerick Aubameyang. Aubameyang. My goodness, it looked as though he was clean through. And the referee, what will he do here? And it is an early shower for him. Red card. Well, the outcome was never in doubt. That was always going to be a sending off. Placed it wide, really close shave. Well, we're inside the final quarter of an hour now. Borja Iglesias. And the cross into the middle. Safe pair of hands, did his job. Barcelona, free kick, it'll be here.
Well, of the dying embers of the game, and Barcelona all. Oh, power. he's through on goal here, Derek. Winging himself has it, the keeper. And he's fired over the corner, attending to his defensive chores. A good effective pressure high up the pitch. De Jong. And a foul in the opinion of the referee. Now, what can they do from this free kick situation? Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. Understandably, he wanted to give it a go, but straight at the keeper. Canales. So three minutes of stoppage time it'll be. William Carvalho. Great challenge, he got nothing but ball. Depay. But he's got past his man. Chances on. In it goes! Such a complete performance. Four in front now. Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. The final whistle has sounded, and it's a victory for Barcelona. You're absolutely right, Derek. Their attacking play was excellent full of energy and pace, and the midfield completely dominated the game. It was a great all-round performance. Well, it was certainly an eye-catching performance from Frenkie de Jong. Sum up his contribution for us. Well, it's a good performance. He worked hard, played well, and scored a goal. And his team won. What more could you ask for?